Hey everyone, in this video I'll be showing you how you can remove a background from a video in the free version of DaVinci Resolve. I'm having video footage on my timeline and then going to the color tab. You can use it to remove any cracks, logos or something else in the background. In my case I'm gonna remove this dot from the wall. So the first step is going to your note panel, right click on your note and select add note serial. Then you want to highlight this new note that you have just created. Then click on this window and you can select any of the tools here. It all depends on the shape of your object. In my case I'm using the circle. So I'm leaving it over the object that I wish to remove. A tiny bit I'm pulling out the outer range so I can add some softness. And because our footage is not steady, we're gonna use the tracker so we can keep track of that mask. You can find the tracker icon right here, so click on it. And then I'm selecting this backwards icon. So I can track everything behind the timeline marker. And then I'm going back to the place where I started tracking, which is here. You can see that there's a keyframe there. And then I'm selecting track forward. And also you can select this icon right here, which is going to track backward and forward at the same time. Then select the transform icon, which is right here. You can check the key lock. And then all you have to do is change the values of pen until your background object is disappear. Just like you're seeing me doing right now. As I am changing the values, the background dot is disappearing. In some cases, if you're using a mask on your second note, there could be a color difference. So you can click on the color wheel, which is right here, and change the gain or anything else until your background color is matching your mask. And now I'm going to the edit tab so I can show you the final result before and after. On the left side is the video that we just cleaned up and on the right is the default one. I hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching and see you in the next one.